Okay, so how many of you have a MySpace? <laughs> how many have like a Facebook? How many of you have a Match.com? <laughs> don't lie, don't be shy. <laughs> okay. Well, how about is anyone in a relationship with someone because of the like the MySpace or Facebook? Huh? Okay. Well, free dating and blind dates are dead. Even if you get set up with someone, you lurk their MySpace. Wanna get to know them and what their favorite book is and whatnot. Um, if you see someone attractive outside, if you're at a party or something, you may recognize them on one of these websites, and you'll probably even try talking to them, because they're hot. So, <laughs> so am I. So am I. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so my claim today is that online dating is superior to dating in the real world. Um, by superior, I mean that online dating is on the rise and people would rather look for love through their computer screen. Um, even through these hard economic times, believe it or not, people are <laughs> wasting all their money on Match.com and all these um, relationship websites. It's actually on the rise by 50% this year, believe it or not. Um, I've got a quote by Dr. Schwartz, who is an expert on the field. Um, at a time when money is scarce or uncertain, when people are assisting their priorities, they don't want to go through it alone. Um, she is a sociology professor at the University of Washington in Seattle. And um, she said 51% increase in new members in the fourth quarter of 2010 with, uh, by 2008, two years ago, um, you're not sure what's coming at you. Love seems all that more important, she feels like, these past three years. Um, I also have a movie critic. Um, how many girls seen who's just not that into you? Or boys? Good movie. It's actually a book, too. And um, she, she stated that um, the movie has a few too many story threads. It also has very funny lines and offers sharp eyed commentary on the state of relationships and my face. So that itself explains a lot. Um, I also have factual data um, on on um, what's his name? Tim Burton. He's um not Tim Burton. That's actually the guy that <laughs> is gonna make the movie on Alice Wonderland that I can't wait to watch. <laughs> <laughs> um, Tim Sullivan. There we go. Um, he's president of Match.com. Um, he feels like every time he walks out and people recognize him, everybody tells him they have a Match.com. The um, a statistic on that would be over 18 million people actually have one of these websites, and um, that's like one in five, yeah, that's like one in five men do a lot of window shopping online. Huh. <clears throat> so he he even said that his sister got married and she's happy. And a lot of people find it easier to date online because, you know, people are busy and, or people are actually not busy and they want to, you know, find someone they love online. Um, uh, personal experiences, my sister met her boyfriend and fiance on MySpace, so did my aunt. I didn't. I didn't meet my boyfriend on there. <laughs> and yeah, so these materials convince me that online dating is on the rise, and it's preferred as it is now as a part of a cultural norm. <coughs> so yeah, people would rather look for love.